Hello, Patrick Walchuk here, and uh, what we have for you is a, a financial analysis on a four-unit building that sold in Ottawa in the month of April, and we'll get right into uh, the numbers and where it was located. So we're calling it east of Ottawa. It's just east of the uh, downtown core, <clears throat> and it was listed for $2.1 million. It sold for $1,900,000. Now, that's a little bit unusual. You don't see that kind of thing typically unless they negotiated a price, then there was a building inspection. The building inspection found that there was latent defects in the property, and so both the buyer and seller uh, agreed to uh, uh, do an amendment on the price. I'm not saying that happened here, but I'm saying that in general that frequently is what happened because we had you know fairly large uh, spread here. So anyhow, the scheduled rental income on this building was $125,000 and change. The effective rental income was almost $122,000, and the operating expenses, as stated in the MLS system, were about $23,000. So when we factor in uh, maintenance and management for total operating expenses, they're $35,000, and so because of that, we now know what our NOI is, so that is $86,000. And because we now know the NOI, and we know the selling price, we can calculate a cap rate. And the cap on this building was 4.5, and that is maybe a little bit higher than average, and certainly for this neighborhood, it's really quite high. <clears throat> now. The operating expenses on the building were 29%, which is quite good, actually. I'd put it in the very good category. Um, it sold for 16 times its gross and 22 times the net income. And for this property, you could buy it and have a positive cash flow with only a 37% down payment. So the, the buyer would have had to put down $703,000 and that provides him with a mortgage of a million one ninety-seven. And what we do is we're calculating a, a mortgage at 5.2% amortized over 25 years, okay? So we know that our annual debt service on the total amount of the mortgage, or our annual debt service is gonna be about $85,000 in the, in the year. And that gives us a positive cash flow of $899 and a positive ROI of 0.13%. So that's how things shook out on this, sorry, this four unit building. Thank you for watching.